Hey YouTube, Harishi Designs here. Just thought I'd do a quick review on the GOSD device from Hobby King. Three parts of this device that come with it. The GOSD board itself, uh, the processor if you like. A lead to connect to your receiver for the RSSI information. And the GPS unit itself. There's a few instructions on how it goes together and how to set it up. Um, they're not great, but they'll do. I plugged in the GOSD board, got it all set up in my plane, had a little bit of a fly around. Luckily, I wasn't relying on it, um, just uh, doing it with sight really to start with. And um, after a few minutes, the board just uh, sent this load of lines across the screen and uh, shut down basically. Um, bit of testing later, uh, I tried powering the GPS unit itself from a separate power supply. I even tried a current limited power supply. Um, I didn't fly the plane, I just left it sitting near the transmitter and receiver so that I could rule out any other problems. And yet still, after about uh, three to five minutes, the same thing, the, the whole thing would just shut down. Um, I then tried it with the GPS unit unplugged and it was fine. It would run for however long you wanted it to or until you run out of batteries, uh, no problems at all. But then what's use uh, an OSD without GPS? Um, no return to home arrow with this or return to home distance either. So if by some miracle you can get it to work, um, whether those are important to you I don't know. But uh, they weren't so important to me but having something that worked was, so this is all going back to Hobby King.